Hey what's up guys welcome to customize the droid back with another custom rom but this time it is for the Tipo dual sim user yes this rom is for the dual sim user only and not for the single sim user so for all those who are uh, the single sim user don't try this rom because anyway the network signal is not going to work at all my phone is the single sim uh, Tipo but still I'm going to install the dual sim custom rom on this phone and will show you how to go about it Basically the ROM name is the Xperia Z1 ROM. So now let's check it out. Let's check with the requirement first. You need your phone to be rooted and the CWM recovery should be installed on your phone. In case if you haven't done that, you can click on this annotations over here or you can check the description column below. The video tutorial is available. It is not necessary that your phone's bootloader should be unlocked. Even if your phone's bootloader is locked, you can still go ahead and install this custom ROM on your phone. So now let's install this custom ROM that is the Xperia Z1 ROM on Sony Xperia Tipo. We will boot into the recovery mode first. So let's go ahead and boot into the recovery mode. Okay, here we are. I am into the recovery mode now. The first thing I would like to tell you guys, if you guys are not familiar with installing the custom ROM, Make sure that you make a backup of your original ROM first via CWM recovery and then go ahead and then install this custom ROM. In order to make a backup of your ROM, you need to go to the option backup and restore and here select backup. This will, If you select this option, it will take a backup on your internal memory card of your phone and you can also take a backup on the external uh, memory card of your phone by selecting backup to external card. The first thing you need to do is to wipe the data. So you will go to the option wipe data factory reset click on this option and then click on yes delete all user data and then you will go to the option wipe cache partition click on yes and then you will go to the option advanced and then here you will select wipe Dalvik cache the second option and then select yes once done uh, go back select option mounts and storage here you will select the option format system select this option and then select yes and then go back now we will install the rom itself so we will select the option install zip from sd card i have kept it on my external sd card of my phone so i will select choose zip from external sd card here i will navigate to the rom itself this is the download downloaded file the xperia z1 style uh, so this is the rom itself select this option and then yes install so now we will wait for the ROM to install completely. You can see Xperia Z1 style. Okay, this is the Aroma installer. So now we will have we will. So now we will have to go ahead in with this Aroma installer. Click on next. Click on next. Then click on continue click on continue and then click on next and then select this option installations and then select install now so now we will wait for the ROM to install completely it's almost done okay uh, now it's done click on next and you can select select this option reboot your device now and then click on finish
So this was the initial boot up for the new custom ROM that is Xperia Z1 ROM for triple dual sim user. So now don't do anything you need to reboot your phone again so that you need to reboot your device again so we will reboot our device or uh, this is a specific instruction this has to be done don't skip this step you need to reboot your device again you have to reboot your device so we'll power it off okay So here we are, now we are with the second boot up of this custom ROM. So this is the new lock screen in this ROM, so I will just unlock the device uh, and we are into the ROM now. So now this ROM is fully functional as my phone is a single SIM and not the dual uh, SIM user. So that's why the signal is not working at all, the network signal it is not working at all. So let's have just a basic look at this ROM. So these are all the apps which you get. Uh, these are all the basic apps, the Sony Xperia Triple app uh, which you get the Walkman app and the movies and the album app and the super user app pre-installed on this ROM let's quickly get into the set settings option of this phone so this is the setting option you get the option for multi sim settings and the auto starts also and the, let's go to the about phone it says the android version 4.0.4 .4. But here you will see the uh, Jelly Bean uh, logo here, here and it's an ICS uh, so this is an ICS form and your model number and the basic info about your phone. So that's it with the installation of this new custom ROM. I'm not going to make a separate video that is the overview video about this ROM because I don't have a Tipo dual phone but as it is a single sim phone. So I don't know how this ROM works and what is the performance of this ROM and how it goes. So it will be you guys who will be commenting on the comment columns and giving me the reviews about this ROM and everything. If I found many more such uh, good ROMs for the Tipo dual user, I will definitely try and make a video by risking my phone by installing the uh, dual sim rom on a single tipo so that that is a bit risky it is possible that i may break my phone but still i am making this uh, video for you guys so that's it in this video if you guys enjoyed this video do hit the like button and comment on the comment column in case of any queries if there is any bugs in this rom comment on the comment column i will try and fix those bugs i will try and find a solution for those bugs and get it fixed so that's it for now in customize the toy don't forget to subscribe to my channel to stay updated with my videos enjoy customizing your phone with this new custom rom that is the xperia c1 for tipo dual sim user till then bye guys enjoy customizing your phone